Yo, what's up, everybody? This is JC, y'all. And I'm back, y'all, with another video and another eye-opening meshes. And this is the meshes, man. I'm going to talk about you got to go through fire. Reveal. You got to go through fire. All right? You got to go through fire. Okay? Every God's followers, you got to go through fire. Okay? And this is the meshes, man, for God's people only. Okay? You got to go through trials tribulations okay you know if you are walking with god and i just let you know this man it's not gonna be that easy it's gonna be harder to walk in with god and i just have to be honest with you all because i know this man because i know this i know heaven is not easy y'all you know what i'm saying but and i just had to do this video to put it out there you know every follows of god you gotta go through fire okay even people in a bible go through fire they go through it okay some of your questions was what well, jc can you explain that to me first thing this y'all if you're not spiritual this message is not for you if you are the person think everything is a game to you this message is not for you if you are the person take my message to the wrong way this message is not for you if you are the person having nerves talk about stop making the videos this video is not for you if you are that person continue to follow the lies of the religions, this message is not for you. If you are that person continue to follow um, the, the, uh, the a fairy tale, this message is not for you. Now back to this message. I'm going to talk about you got to go through the fire in your walks with God. Okay? If you really love God, if you're trying to, if you're trying to go up higher in your walks with God, you already know what I need to say. You already know what to do. You got to go through fire, man. You got to go through fire. You got to go through trial, tribulations, okay? All you need to do, first thing this, you got to cut all your people off. That's right. You got to cut all the people off. You got to cut off your mama off, your daddy off, those who don't have God. You got to cut all the people off. You cut up your, your ex-girlfriend, your ex-boyfriend. You ask friends, y'all hang with, you got to cut them off, man. And guess what, man? Be honest with you, I got to tell you, man. I got to say it, man. They will hate you. They will talk bad about you. They will backstabbing you. And and, and, and and also, they number gospel. They talk about you, okay? That's a trial, tribulation you're going to be been through, okay? That's right. That's a trial you're going to be through, okay? If you're trying to go make it in your walks with God, you're going to go through some haters, Okay? Your family's gonna be your new haters. Your your relationship, your girlfriend, your man is gonna be your new haters. Even your job, your social worker. You know, even your even even your cousin, your grandma, and your and your papa, man. You got some new haters gonna be after you, man. Okay. All you need to do, you gotta be bold. You gotta be strong, man. It goes to me too. It goes to my girl too. You gotta be bold. You gotta be strong, man. I'm telling y'all, man, God want us to be strong. He don't want us to be a coward. Hell no. He don't want us to be a coward. He wants y'all to be bold. He tests everybody. You see what I'm saying? He tests everybody, not just one person. He tests anybody. He, he tests me. He tests my girl. He tests my family and her family, too. He tests everybody. He just want to make sure we love him. You know what I'm saying? If you love God, he puts you in a test. He, he, he allowed things to happen, okay? God allowed things to happen to you, okay? It's just like God allowed happen to Joe. Joe lost his family. You see what I'm saying? He lost his family. He lost his wife. He lost his kids, man. You know, God allowed Satan to kill all his people. And Joe lost everything. He was hurt. He's in pain. He's so in love with his, with his wife and his kids, man. Because God wants Joe to be strong. Can't y'all hear what I'm saying? This not this stuff is not funny, man. This stuff is not funny. This stuff is seriously, man. You know what I'm saying? See, it's so sad. You know, got so many people in church, majority of Christians out there. You know, they're not they're not really making good good doors to the end, man. All that do is just listen to the pastor all the time. You know what I'm saying? Most Christians out there, they are cowards. You know. I don't mean to criticize, but I got to speak truth, you know? Most Christians out there, they are cowards. They're scared to go doors to the end. 
You know why? What is it, JC? Because they're scared to go through the fire. That's that's the problem. They scared to go through the fire. You know what I'm saying? And how you how you gonna live? How you have a deeper one relationship with God and you never go through the fire? You need to tell me. I got God in my life. You know what I'm saying? I have a deeper one relationship. I fast. I read the Bible. I preach the word of God. I play the piano. I'll be in the choir and all that. I'll say, okay, okay, okay. That's cool. That's cool. You're not done. What what about what about you go through the fire? Okay, what, what, what about you go through the fire? You're missing that picture. You see what I'm saying? You're missing that picture. You know, some of Christians say, Well, I don't know about that. That's your problem. You don't know about that. So how you so how you gonna go so how you have a relationship with God and you never go through the fire? Every God's followers go through the fire. Even the Bible. People in the Bible go through the fire. Man, let me give you an example. Let's start with Joe, man. Okay? I already told you about Joe. You already you, you already know the book of story about Joe. You know what I'm saying? He's a black man. Okay, he's a black man in the Bible, King James Version. Okay, he got a beautiful wife and his kids, y'all. And, and and Satan told God, cannot take his people out. And God said, go ahead, do so. I said for Joe. So God allowed Satan to kill Joe's family, his wife and his kids. That was in the Bible, y'all. Man, go read, go read for yourself, man. Be honest with you. I heard of him, but I was reading the Bible yet, though. Joe was in the Bible, y'all. You know, Joe lost everything. Joe been through a fire. He been through trials, tribulation, real bad, man. He go through the fire in his walks with God. He trying to go up higher and higher, man. And guess what? He make it. He make it through the hundred. See, you got so many Christians out there, they're not making it through the 100. You know why? Because most Christians out there, they're number 10. they number 10. They ain't think about going to the next level. All that do, just listen to the pastor, obey the pastor, what pastor told her to do. That's it. Pastor told the people, throw monies at them. They throw monies at them. That's it, man. But most Christians out there, they ain't think about going through the fire. You know, most people are weak minded, man. They are weak minded, go through the fire, man. They're not they're not strong enough. They're not strong enough, you know what I'm saying? Cause Satan, Satan got him, man. Satan got him, man. Satan got him weak. And God, he can't the most high, Yeshua, man, he can't stand cowardly. I don't blame him. I don't blame him, y'all. See? So you got to understand about God, man. You talk about you love God, you live with God and all that stuff, but you never thought about go through the fire. That's, come on, man. That's, that's come on, that's number of hypocrite going on, man. You got to be bold. You got to, that's the first time doing videos like this, man. You know, I'm, I'm so hungry with the truth because, you know what I mean, that, that truth, man, they really going to set me free. They really say y'all free too, man. I'm telling y'all, man. You gotta go through trials, tribulation. I don't care how much you pray. I don't care how much you read the Bible. I don't care how much you're talking to God. I don't care how much you're going to church. I don't care how much you're going to the choir, play the piano and drum set. I don't care how much you go going to Bible study. Every follows of God go through the fire and go doors to the end. You gotta go through the end. You see what I'm saying? And see, it, that was so sad. Preachers never thought about talking about that stuff. Most preachers out there don't never heard about go through the fire. Go through the fire means like you got to go through tests, man. You got to go through a lot of trials, tribulations, man. You got to cut all your people off. You see what I'm saying? You got to cut all your people off. And that's God. God put you in a test for a reason. He put everybody in a test. He put me in a test. You see what I'm saying? I'm telling y'all, man, test is not going to be that easy, y'all. I'm just being real honest. I'm just being real honest, y'all. I, you know, I already talked to my, my fiance on the phone. I said, little baby, I love you. You need to cut your family off. Your family don't got God in your life. 
your family, they trying to do it in the power, trying to get you back over there. They can control you and torture you and take your money out your pocket and, and, and hook you up with, with somebody else. I said, I said, baby, you got to cut your people off. You got to cut the people off, baby. You know, I'm not forcing you, you know what I'm saying? I'm not making you do things, but if you really, if you really, really love God in your life, in your mind, your soul, you got to cut the people off. That's a test. God put you in a test. If you really, really follow God, God will put you in a test for a reason. He put me in a test. He put everybody in a test. He put every people in the damn Bible. Go, uh, go, 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 go put people in the test, man. I told my old lady, I said, look, baby, you got to cut the people off. Because your people don't have God in their life. Cut off your sister off. Cut off your brothers off, man. Because no one don't have God in their life. They don't want to follow God's truth. All they do is number drama. All they do, babe. I told my girl, I said, babe, your family is number drama, number trouble, number Ill, 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 evilness, number hater, backstabber, lust, full of pride. I said, her family is just full of evil and full of lust and full of pride and full of drama. Got a lot of things going on in her family. I told my baby, you got to cut the people off, man. And, and guess what? I'm just being real honest. Your people going to be hate you, and they're going to hate me even more worse than they hate you. That's right. And look and look what happened. Majority of her family never called her just because she with me. You know? Let's be real honest. Now, I got people who hate me, too. Most people in my family, they don't want to be bothered with me because they think I'm crazy. You know what I'm saying? Majority of my people think I'm crazy. They think I'm trying to be like my mama. No, I will never be like my mama. I'm different than my mama. I ain't not, I'm not the pagan Christian. My mama is a pagan Christian, y'all. You know? See, that's what y'all been doing, man. That's that's what y'all should be doing. You got to cut your people off. Stop worrying about other people telling you and all that stuff. You're going you're gonna to go through trials, man. I don't care. I don't care if you're a female or male. I don't care if you're a boy or girl, elderly. I don't care how. I don't care who you are, man. You're gonna go through fire. You got. You gotta go through the fire. You got. You gotta go through your, in your walks with God. You gotta go through the ends. Now let me give you an example. Let's start with Christ. Christ Yeshua. He go through the fire. Yes, he is. Let's get real, y'all. Let's get realistic. Stop playing around. Stop playing around, man. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Stop acting like you don't know what I'm talking about. The Christ Yeshaya. The black, the real Christ. He been through a lot. He going through the fire. Yes, he is. He, he going through the fire. You already know the story about Christ got beat up. You know, he got spit in his face. They tortured him. Stop beating him up. And he, he got whipped, man. Jesus got... Jesus got whipped real bad, man. And, and he died on the tree. He suffered, man. Christ go through the fire, man. For us. Yes, yes, he is. God, I mean, Christ go through the fire with God, man. He he died for us on a tree, y'all. He died for us our sins. And I'm telling you, man, Christ loves y'all. He wants y'all to live forever. He wants y'all to follow him all the way to the end. But the church is yours. You see what I'm saying? Let me give you more example. Let me give you more example. Let's start with Noah. God told Noah to build a boat because God finally destroyed the city. So Noah, he, he been through a lot because they got so many haters out there tease him. Like crazy. People trying to kill Noah. Noah been through a lot. Yes, he is. Noah been through uh, trial, tribulation. That means he, he been through a fire. Let's start with John the Baptist. John the Baptist, he wasn't in prison. He was in prison, y'all. And look what happened. Just for that, John the Baptist got his head cut off. Because he do the real will of the Father. Even John the Baptist go through the fire. Don't get me wrong, y'all. Moses too. Moses go through the fire. Daniel go through the fire. Even Joseph. Who 
Oh, yes, man. All the people go through the fire, even David, too. You know? See, it's so sad, man, you know. People are just scared to talk about things, you know. You know, you know, man, people just be a hypocrite, man. They know the truth. They're just, just so afraid to talk about things, you know. You got to go through the fire. You got to go through the fire, man, with God. You got to go through doors to the end. I'm telling y'all, it's not going to be that easy, man. You know, if people so soft, people so weak-minded, they can't do it, man. They're going to stay number 20. They die for the time, they're going to hell, man. And I'm going to tell you, man, heaven is not easy. Now, I'm just being real honest. You know, pastor be lying to us all the time, talk about if you follow God, it's going to be easy for y'all to go to heaven. That's a lie, man. That's a totally lies. The real truth is, any way you get to heaven, you gotta go through the ends. Of the, you gotta go through. You gotta go through fire. You gotta go through fire. You gotta go through trial, tribulation. You gotta do God's will in your life. You gotta with good do what God calls you to do, man. You gotta go through doors to the end. Then you save. See, that's what preachers don't want to talk about, you know. And I'm just be real honest, y'all. That's all I got to be saying, man. Just JC, y'all. I had to do this video. Just do what I can to put a troop out there, man. You know, every God's followers go through fire. You got to go through, you got to go through fire, man. You got to go through do ours to the end, man. They got so many people that are weak-minded. They can't, they can't make it. They're not strong enough, you know. It's just, re, you know, just re sad, you know, but. It's the first time I do this kind of videos like this. God want me to do this video, so I had to obey God, you know. So that's all I got to be saying, man. This is JC, y'all. I'm John Carew. I'm out, y'all. Y'all be cool. Peace.